This will be a read aloud of 10 magic butterflies. While you listen to the story and when the story is finished, you have two tasks. You will write an addition sentence for each combination of 10 that the book shows of flowers and butterflies. So you will write the number of flowers you see plus the number of butterflies that you see to get our total of 10. There will be several combinations. You will also draw them on 10 frames. So for each combination that you find, if you see five flowers and five butterflies, on your 10 frame, you will show a picture that matches. So you might draw five simple flowers and five simple butterflies. 10 Magic Butterflies by Danica McKellar. Once upon a time, there were 10 flower friends. Were they always happy? Well, that depends. All day long, they soaked up the sun, talking and laughing and having fun. Ha ha ha, he he he. They loved being flowers, but they couldn't deny that they had a secret desire to fly. They watched every eve as the fairies flew from the moonlit night to the morning dew. Whoosh, wee. Then one starry night, a flower felt brave. She spotted a fairy and started to wave. Said the tiny blue one, fairy up in the sky. You see, I'm a flower, but I want to fly. Huh? Oh. Hello there, my friend. You smile and you sing. Why would you want to be a different thing? I'm tired of being a flower just stuck on the ground. I want new adventures to zoom all around. The fairy shrugged. Okay, and she closed her eyes. Time to get ready for a big surprise. With a wave of her wand and a bing bang boo, the fairy said, now you're a butterfly, Blue. One butterfly flew as nine flowers looked on. There were still 10 of them in the sky on the lawn. Said the bossy green one, fairy up in the sky, hey, make me some wings, cause I wanna fly. With a wave of her wand and a bing bang boo, the fairy said, now you're a butterfly too. Two butterflies flew as eight flowers looked on. There were still 10 of them in the sky on the lawn. Said the silly orange one, fairy up in the sky, could I flutter and flip? Will you help me to fly? With a wave of her wand and a bing bang boo, the fairy said, now you're a butterfly too. Three butterflies flew as seven flowers looked on. There were still 10 of them in the sky on the lawn. Next, four and six. Bing, bang, boo. Then five and five. The brand new butterflies felt alive. Yes, one by one, they filled the sky as the sweet little fairy helped each to fly. The 10 new butterflies flew all night, zooming and swooping. What a sight. Zing, zang, zoom. When morning came and the sun peeked through, their wings were tired and the wind really blew. Whoa, bonk, thud. They watched other flowers soak up the sun as beads and birds, bees and birds kissed them one by one. And they said, and then they said together, all 10, we actually want to be flowers again. It was fun to fly, but now we're sad. We really do miss all the things we once had. Sniff, sniff. It wasn't bad when we were flowers, so strong and sturdy with lots of powers. We made perfume and cleaned the air, gave plenty of nectar for all to share. I thought you'd change your mind, she cried. The grass is always greener on the other side. Sometimes we wish for different things, to change color or size or even get wings. 
but big and tall or short and small, being ourselves is best of all. So let's go back to you being you with fairy dust and a bing, bang, boo. Yippee! Then 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4. They floated down to the garden floor. Now seven on the ground and three, two, go. Then three, two, one, zoomed high to low. Was that a dream or did they fly? Can flowers end up with wings in the sky? Who knows what happens while we're asleep? Could dogs become horses and bugs become sheep? Nay, ba? Yes, magic surrounds us. It takes many forms, from rainbows and moonlight to tropical storms. Frogs come from tadpoles that swim in the stream, and each night you grow with every dream. Shh. So don't be surprised if this story is true and magical butterflies come to see you. You might see one fluttering late, late at night or in your dreams. Sleep tight. Now remember, your job is to write an addition sentence for each combination of 10 that the book shows of flowers and butterflies, like this. And then you should draw them on 10 frames, like this. Happy solving!